Besting Odin, you've done the unthinkable. A single mistake could have spelled certain doom, but your persistence paid off in the end. With his mighty Zontetsken, this master of the blade will certainly help you cut a path to victory. Needless to say, many hazards await you on the road, so take care. About your mother. Her name's Afalna, right? Maybe. So what? That sounds like a yes to me. I called it the second I saw you. Boy, am I ever glad I sent up smoke. Tell me, how's she doing? Good? No. She's dead. <clears throat> You know, the whole reason I joined Shinra was to become a pilot. But I wound up as a gopher for some lazy grease monkeys. Had me running around HQ fixing lights and whatnot. One time, though, I came across a pretty young thing with a little girl in her arms. That was you, wasn't it? Probably. <laughs> you were knee-high to a tonberry. I was what? Oh, it's a smogger, I'd wager. <laughs> Damn. No longer with us. That's a crying shame. Truly. Hey, Missy. It's Aerith. Aerith. Is there anything I can do for you? I want to help. What? Why? I uh, just trying to do right by you. <laughs> Flying us around will be more than plenty. Thanks. 
Then again, if you're just dying to help, you could take us to the saucer for free. Free? It's fine, we'll pay. Now it's on me. When you want to head to the saucer, just give me a holler. Hey, good to go? Let's get a move on then. <laughs> Uh-huh. Hmm? Huh. An eight? You said that Sephiroth is your foe. I have a history with him. Unfinished business. Hmm? He bothering you? Want me to give him the boot? Try to screw us over, and you're a dead man. Hmm. Please, uh, take a seat. You can manage eight? Ain't gonna lie. That's a tall order for most pilots. <sighs> Lucky for you, I ain't most pilots. Any land in your 
can swim away from. <laughs> you almost killed us. Okay, let's start her up. <laughs> Sounds good. Yeah, but the wings are still broken. And what of it? Only one man has mastered the land, air, and sea. You're looking at it. You got that? Okay, so? So, you can think of me as the captain of your ship. Strap on in and we'll punch through the chop. Aye, aye. <laughs> Let's set sail. Straight through the ravine and on to Costa del Sol. And after that, we hit it. Sounds like a plan. We'll be there before you know it. Let's set a course for Costa del Sol. Roger that! Full speed ahead! Hey, mind filling us in on the Keystone before we arrive? Gladly. About 20 years back, one of my more eccentric colleagues convinced the company to build a museum for his antiques. The reliquary, they called it. Pretty cool, eh? Now, according to company records, the Keystone was housed there. Wait a second. I am getting to that. To the threat. Here was I. Oh, right. So, the museum turned out to be a total flop. Closed as soon as it opened. But, somewhere between cutting the ribbon and boarding up the windows, the keystone vanished into the thin air. So it's not at the saucer? Do you know where it went? No, but I know a man who went. The former curator. Deal. Hmm? How do you know that name? Let's just say. After the museum debacle, all deal was devoted only to be promoted again when the saucer took off. Made director in no time, a real riches to rags to riches story. All of which is why we're bound for the saucer. Hey Sid, did I hear right? You used to work with Shinra. Still do, on occasion. The boys got their uses. That's gonna be a problem. You see, we don't take kind of friends of the company. And I don't take kindly to that tone of yours. Man who tries to lord his power over me is gonna wish he didn't. <laughs> That's what's appealing about the skies. I'm all to myself. Rats can have their race in the gutter. Never much cared for the squeaking anyways. <laughs> I miss the wild blue yonder dearly.
Johnny's all filled up by now. Damn it, his hotel's found its, uh, ceilings. Fat chance. Kid probably got grifted again and was crying himself to sleep every night. Thank you for choosing Bronco Cruises. We sincerely hope you enjoyed your trip with us. Cruises? I thought it was Bronco Airlines. Not after his wings got clipped. <laughs> Seriously, we really appreciate you ferrying us around. You're most welcome. Hey, y'all are headed to the saucer, ain't you? I might could tag along, take in the splendor. What do you think? Of course. Girl always knows just what to say. Am I right? Shall we? <laughs> Wait a sec. Where's Vincent? Up there. Another loner. As if one wasn't enough of a pain in my ass. Yeah, one's more than enough. <laughs> you mean me? Should split up to look for Dio. Will do. If I catch you goofing off, so help me out. Uh, uh Cloud, you got a minute? There's something I failed to mention about the Temple of the Ancients. You might call it a legend or a warning. Uh huh. You see. No one who goes into the temple ever comes out again. No one. And I'm wondering if you really want to take everyone to a place like that. You said it yourself. It's just a legend. I did, aye, but... Let's focus on finding Dio and the Keystone for now.
Bad news. No sign of Dio whatsoever. While we're talking, did you know this is where Jesse used to perform? Yeah. Oh. If she was with us, she'd probably be gushing about the role she played. Or maybe not. Maybe she'd be mad to see this place burning through more Mako than ever. Either way, she'd have kept us entertained. Yeah, ain't that the truth? Where would you like to go, Kubo? Hold on to your hat, Kubo! Can you hang on a sec? I 
kinda busy here. Alright. You're the boss. <laughs> Cloud! Don't even think of lecturing me. I already did my recon. And it turned up squat, okay? Anyway... You wanna throw down? underwent extensive renovations and was outfitted with state-of-the-art technology. Even today, the Gold Saucer continues to expand with new attractions currently in the works. I can't wait to see who Guts of blood, screams of pain. Dio's not here. Dio's around here. Do any of them realize war is about to break out? They do, but people always think war is someone else's problem until they're in the thick of it. Cloud, I gotta be honest. Hmm? For the longest time, I wanted to do everything. I wanted to fight for the planet, convince people to stand up, take action with us. But it's like I always come up short. Always. No matter what I try, I'm in over my head. Maybe I am lost, but knowing your limits is one of the keys to knowing yourself. You're not. And we're not the dumb kids who fell off Mount Evil anymore. We're not powerless, and we're not alone. So don't ever stop trying, Tifa. Ever. You just gotta stick it out. Don't give up now. Okay. Thanks. I needed that. All right, now let's go find Dio. Cool. Always come up short. Hey, lovebirds. Tickets to tomorrow's match are almost sold out. Battle. Your trusty guy, Mumu, is at your service. Hold on to your hat, Mumu. And here we are! Check it out, Cloud. Can you believe this? Corneo? The Dawn outstayed his welcome in Midgar and decided to set up shop in the saucer. Great timing, eh? Interesting. There's an event being held at the Musclehead Coliseum tomorrow. If there's a dress rehearsal today, Dio might be there. We should check it out. Greetings, Mr. Director! Hmm, he doesn't he look quite right. Hmm. Well, if it isn't our friendly fugitives, you're looking hale and hearty. What happened to you? I made a painful discovery. 
that the Turks are stronger than they look. You, sir, should know better. You're no spring chicken. Speaking of old things, whatever happened to that wee keystone thingy? We need to get our hands on it. Hmm. It was part of your collection, last we heard. Hmm. It was, yes. And in fact, still is. Point of order, my ancestors owned it. Don't you think that makes me its rightful owner? Hmm. A cetera, are you? That, my dear, is a bold claim. <laughs> but still, who am I to dispute your heritage? You may, of course, have the keystone. That is, on one condition. You must take part in our exclusive event, the fight for naming rights. Dio's champions versus the Corneo family. Should my team fall to those rogues, the Gold Saucer will become Corneo Land. Let's sit out. Training hard and getting those games. What's up, party people? What's up? It's a challenge from the dark. Find and glory. Give us people what they want. Take it in a piece. But look at me. I can barely lift a finger. And here I was, lamenting my lot in life, when you came along. Tis fate. Nay, divine intervention. What say you? Will you be my champions and go to war against Don Corneo? I'll do it. I'll fight. We win, we get the keystone. Right? As agreed, you have my word. Then we're in. Then we have ourselves a deal. <laughs> Naturally, I want you in peak physical condition for the big bout, so please use my hotel to rest up. Great! I'll jog on ahead and tell the others that. The fate of the gold saucer rests on your shoulders. Don't let me down. Here we are!